What? Katy Perry called me a hun. Another exclusive, it was Sophie's fault. That was the worst. Like, that was proper, like, gut-wrenching. He thinks he's, like, the got Brian of relationships. She needs to go on the chase or something because my girl knows how to play a game. <gasps> I proper like him. Um, you know what, it's one of them, I can have a word with him in there because I think me and him Hi guys and welcome back to I Saw It First IGTV and we have G Stillback. Hi guys, so I went to South Africa and um, I didn't get on Love Island but I did bring someone very special back with me. Not only is she an Aries like me, <laughs> she also supports Arsenal like me but she also went through the same experience as me. So I'm so glad that we have Shauna in the house today. Yep, hashtag we didn't survive Castle and War. <laughs> Castle and no Castle and oh, no Still a bit raw for me, right? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> but we're here doing a question and answers with the lovely Shauna, so let's get started. What's it been like since leaving the villa? It has been mental. An absolute. Like, I've still not been home. Not yet? So, nope. So, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. So, four days. Oh. Still not been home. Still not been in my own bed. It's um, hard. Yeah. And like, yeah. I used to be buzzing over like maybe like over 100 likes yeah like once i'd hit triple digits i'm like oh, i'm the okay. <laughs> and now yeah it's mental <laughs> in, so <laughs> in a way though that's kind of similar to me because like i was just a shop girl and I, what did yeah. you do before again Shauna? so i worked in democratic services yeah so like, we weren't no, instagram I don't know what it is either we weren't, in, we weren't, in, we weren't instagram girls no. let's put it so then for that massive change, like it is quite overwhelming, ain't well, it? I I think I went in one of the like, as the girl with the least followers. Yeah, same as me. I was the same. And um, you've got the most now, so. Woo! I mean, yeah. I don't like talking about it, but I I'm don't want to break. break. <laughs> <laughs> I love no, amazing. <laughs> so obviously, you went in with the least followers yeah. when you went into the villa, and you've left with the most followers, which is amazing. But how does that make you feel? Like it's scary yeah like, it's overwhelming yeah. definitely i think i've got two hundred thousand since that day <gasps> and i don't know what i'm doing like i was just being a tw <laughs> like just myself yeah. i haven't watched it back here so i don't even know mm. i mean i know about the kit kat <laughs> yeah we, we, we don't talk kit about the kit kat we keep the one quiet honestly what like what, what? Are you just got kit kat stashed everywhere then or is this just there was thing? another one in there as well there was two there kit kats my two god that's exclusive we had two kit kats there but another exclusive it was sophie's fault why? Yeah. Because whenever we'd get like snacks, we would just, because they'd go so quickly, we'd just grab and run. I think also though, you were really relatable and I feel like that's what makes people really like latch on because yeah. everyone knows a friend like you, Shauna, or they've been like you or like yeah. a family member. So everyone can relate to you, Definitely. which I think is so important. hundred percent. I think seeing like young girls write to me, like you've made me feel like I can be myself. Like, oh. Oh. But you get more confident with age. Like you, you yeah. start realizing that I definitely there's agree things with that, yeah. that aren't important. And I think if I can show that to young girls and make their life a little yeah. bit easier, I'll take it on the chin. Oh, that's so, so nice. So, <laughs> so obviously, with you being in Love Island, you did have your one-liners. Everyone knows them. They've been trending on Twitter, Instagram, whatnot. But what was your favourite one that Sean said? Sean, you said something once to Callum. And I, it, it hurt my heart. Oh no! It, you said something like, "Don't, oh, no. don't talk, don't speak to me, or something." Speak to me. oh what? yeah. So this is the best night I've ever had in my life, and all the girls speaking was like, yeah. "I really felt that." Don't listen to respond. Listen to understand. My mm -hmm. favourite one was um, if Chloe can get through this, then I can. Yeah. That was amazing. And I think about that every day now. Do you? You got yeah. up. Like, to I think in life. there's people worse off than me. Yeah. Like what if Chloe Kardashian can make it through 2019? Listen, yeah. With him, like, cheating on her with Jordan Wood and... A hundred percent. Like, even if you're, like, leaving the nail salon and you don't like the colour you've just chosen... You think about it. If Chloe Kardashian can get, get through it, you can get through yeah. that. Yeah. Make sure exactly. you ah, I love how normal she says it. Like, I just dead normal. I love it, that. It ah. is. It's true. It used to be if Britney can get through 2009, but Chloe's... Oh, it's like that now. She's so who are your best friends in the villa? Who are your friends for life in there? I think we'll all be friends for life because you have mm. that connection with them. And I'm um, also the first ones in that villa. We're like we know the logistics and all it that. It was massive, by the it way. Was it was ridiculous. Um, a hundred percent. Paige is like my soulmate. Yeah. Not even that. a best friend. Oh. Like she's my angel. I've missed her so much. Yeah. And Leanne and Sophie. Like I've already seen them. Now I'm back. 
I like, even out of them, yeah, yeah, yeah. I love but that. do you know what? I think because we're all from London and we're all like kind of the same kind of girls. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It was like home away from home in there. Probably girls, girls. In yeah, there. that's lovely. But all the girls in there got along well. Yeah. Is there anyone you didn't? Um, didn't get on with as much as maybe some of the others like Paige and Sophie. Like who would you um, say? So there was no arguments necessarily in there. Rebecca is the most lovable nightmare you've ever met. We kept on hearing this. What does that mean? She's just. I can't, she was just hilarious, like I can't, but accidentally. Yeah. When obviously she first came in, it was a little bit awkward because obviously the whole yeah. Callum thing, the heart thing and all of that. Um, so that was a little bit sticky to begin with. Right. But then I couldn't imagine the video without her. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah, she's kind of Yeah. Um, and I suppose maybe me and Shanice didn't do too much with each other in there. Right. Um, I think we just different. it's hard because you kind of latch on to different people don't yeah. you and it's like they become friends with certain people and then some people in the relationships are much stronger just as a, them as the couple oh, and, yeah, and they'll chill with each other yeah. but oh. no apart from that that was one of the hardest things like even when there was drama in there like when me and Eve was in a triangle to begin with with yeah. Callum oh bloody hell I know that like, was back like in ages the old days ago. but me and Eve were like such good friends like we'd come yeah. back and we'd be like so how was it like, of course he's going to choose you, you're amazing. Like, <laughs> it was so weird and so awkward. So, I remember the argument you had with Sophie, briefly, because it was quite a while ago now, and yeah. I remember you being friends afterwards. Yeah. But what was that, like, really about, and what, what made you so angry? So, what happened was, before there was a recoupling that night, yeah. and it was me, Callum, Leanne, and Sophie on <gasps> the bed. I remember, and she was asking them to recouple with her. I just think no, no. Was, yeah so it was something so Demi had just come in um, we weren't De Demi was really feeling Naz we didn't know whether Naz was feeling Demi so much right um, but I was getting along well yeah and I can't I can't remember who said it but someone said um, oh to Callum like when you go and talk to the boys make sure they know um, that we want to stay which listen it's your love and experience you do what you've got to do like if you want to stay in there that's fine um, but I just didn't want it to be to the detriment of Demi, especially if he, Naz was really connecting with Demi. Yeah, of course. Um, and I thought it was Sophie that said it, and I, I haven't watched it back, I don't know whether she did or not. Um, but so it was that that kind of, that's why I said he it's shouldn't hard. be put in that position. It's hard because I feel like when, when it gets back to you through other people, I think you heard through Callum, didn't you? Did he, oh, just did a he, little bit, yeah. Yeah, he said it to you, and then you, you had the conversation with Sophie, didn't you? So that's no, how it went. No, so I was, so I had the conversation with Sophie. I said, oh, like, I hope, uh, this was after Leanne had gone. Mm. I said, oh, so are you done with Connor? Because I thought, why would you want to stay if you've got someone out, out there? Totally, anyway? totally agree with that. Yeah, yeah. And I like the fact that you heard that, to be fair, because yeah. you said what a lot of people were thinking. Well, I would have just, I would have been... you got to try love, don't you? Callum's point to me was, that's your best friend, why do you think that? And I said, no, but... I would have been fake if I hadn't yeah, said Yeah, no, to her. I think it was good you said that. And it doesn't make, it doesn't mean that she was, I, I loved her any less or that I didn't like her. I just thought I'd, I need to say That's it. what a true uh, friend yeah. is saying, yeah. is when you address certain situations yeah. and you don't think are right, and you can that's what up. a proper yeah. friend is. So what initially made you like Callum? <laughs> oh. <laughs> there's, there's a lot of Callum questions to learn. Um, don't get me wrong, I still think he's a good looking boy. Like, yeah. he is a good looking she boy. Is. Yeah, yeah, of course. Um, and like, even now, there's no other boy that I would have coupled up with or that I fancied other than Luke M at towards the end. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, yeah. So it wasn't necessarily like I'd missed out on someone for him. Um, I thought he was a good looking boy. He did make me laugh because he was just some of the things that he used to come out with. It's just like, what? He said some funny lines though. <laughs> and do you know, but he also knows his mental facts. I know, I've heard this. What do you mean? Like, like stars and stuff. St uh, stars and like, if someone said, oh, like, so how deep is the, like, Earth's equator or, or whatever. He'd know. Yeah, he was just nice. And I'm just like, what? So I think I was kind of interested. That's in yeah, that's interesting. I'd yeah. be like, how do you know that? Yeah. And I'm thinking, oh, tell me more facts. Yeah, no he way. definitely follows that, that Twitter page. like Uber facts. Yeah, <laughs> Uber facts. Oh. Facts Believes everything. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so obviously when the Casper Moore thing went on and Callum brought Molly back um, into the Papa Villa, how did that make you feel? Obviously it was not the best um, feeling, especially because she is stunning. Yeah. And the thing is as well, when every other boy had come back, the, like the ones that did bring girls, we could see two shadows, so we knew. But with that, with Callum, I don't know what he was doing with Molly, but I only saw one. So oh, I thought, oh my joking. God, maybe he's not. And then he'd come out, and then I saw her, and I was like, 
Oh, oh, you joke. Yeah, yeah. I can't remember how it felt. I mean, you've both been in the same situation. Yeah, you? it's just, I did genuinely think he was going to bring a girl back. Same. You really thought that? A hundred percent. All the girls are going, no, you're solid. And I'm like, girls, I know. And you know in your gut, being a woman with every good intuition. Yeah. And I feel like if you know, you just you just have that feeling, yeah. that gut sensation. Yeah. You both handled it so well. I think you did it. You made it. it was. I was so impressed. I thought you were gonna s- start swinging for him or something. Everyone, instead, you, you firmed yeah, it so normal. Yeah, everyone thought I was gonna go nuts. Did, they even had security. What, what, was, what, the line? Like, what was the line? What was the line? Congrats, hun. <laughs> I love that so That's much. Trending. So chilled as well. Oh, that I one. I can be very sharp with my tongue, so I think that was the time. When and do you know what I was trying so hard to make eye contact with him, and that boy was looking to the floor, and I thought, "Look at me." Oh, he must. Yeah, he must have felt so. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. But no, do you know what? That feeling of him coming down was not as bad as when I realised he didn't leave me like a going away present, and all the other girls got something. Because right. bearing in mind, me and him had been together since day one. And all the other couples were like relatively new. Yeah. The fact that he left me nothing. You were just like. That was the worst. Like, that was proper, like, gut wrenching. Who do you think is playing the game? They're still in there. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I know who you're going to say because everyone in the UK thinks it. Well, I called it pretty early in the. You did. The kiss, the suck I just, and think, blow I just think it's odd. Some of his behaviour, I just think, I don't I don't understand. I actually we haven't even named a name, by the way. I'm just running off on stuff. Do we have a name? Michael. I do believe him and Priscilla. Mm. I do think, because you can't be in there, and I mean, Priscilla's a beautiful girl and she's a lovely girl. How could you not like her? So, yeah. But I think he over eggs how he feels. To make it look perfect to the yeah, public. Yeah, that's why I said like he thinks he's like the got wine of relationships because mm. he felt like he was literally married off and could then give people advice. Do you know what? I'll be honest. Him and Priscilla actually look really good together. And they do. I think he's. I th- it's just a shame that he went for every other girl before he got to Yeah, yeah. and <laughs> what I think funny, it, I it? think what the issue is is he's saying what he said to all the other girls to Priscilla, so it's making. The people in the yeah. villa think, um, is this genuine, is yeah. this not? So, um, do you know what I he actually said? Know. So he said to Jess, just before Cassa, like, we didn't know what he said he was leave, coming up, he? he said he would leave if Jess got voted out. And I was literally like, her twin sister has left and she has stayed. Are you trying to say to us that you have deeper feelings for Jess than she has for Eve? Yeah. Like, you, you ain't gonna leave. Yeah. But I mean, I've got a shout out to Natalia. She needs to go on the chase or something because my girl knows how to play a game. <gasps> like, she would have oh, popped up with a lamp post. Oh, goodness me. Some tea right there. I thought she was so <laughs> nice, to be fair. Right, I did. I thought she was gorgeous. I thought, oh, she's lovely, this girl. But after been watching it, I'm thinking exactly like the same thing. Do you not just think it's quite hard when she's had such a short period of time in there? Like, you haven't really got to see the full hurt, though. Is oh, that but not... the thing is, if she was. I don't know whether I want to see more. If she was playing a game with Luke M to get into the main villa, make that last longer than half a day before you start saying that you don't know if yeah, it's I wasn't in there, so I didn't actually know how long it... Half a day. And she started really, crying really. and stuff, I just thought... Yeah. And not only that, even when she did start being like that, she started being quite rude to Luke. Right. Yeah, I saw... And he's like, he's yeah. standing solid. He's like, bring you in here. Like, don't start being... Especially to Luke yeah. M, that's like Saint Luke. Yeah. He's an he's angel. He's lovely, yeah. So, since you're quite the villa, has anyone famous slid into your DMs? Because we all want to know this and we ask everyone that comes on. Um. <laughs> no blue tick is in there. There's a few blue ticks. Okay. Ooh, there's a few. A few? Ticks. Oh, you caught me out. <laughs> <laughs> no, do you know I'm going to do a big shout out? Holly from Geordie Shaw. Oh, Holly Geordie Shaw? Yes. Yeah, yeah. But she has been backing me. Like, I, I can't like, read back now from yeah, like, watching yeah. when she was chatting with my family and stuff. Oh. And she's been so lovely. But what's weird is like, you're starstruck. Because it's like, yeah. I'm like, I'm like, I'm like Holly, years. hi. Yeah. It's, yeah, it's weird. Laura Whitmore, she like oh. said that like, it was lovely to see me. And, what, and like, Laura Whitmore, I've, I've seen her. Like, I've yeah. worked with her. And now I'm like, oh my god, Laura, but, hi. No, it was, it was, it was one thing. It was better who did, wasn't it? Yes. It's, she we, was calling Cam trash. Trash. Yeah. Well, oh my god, that is Love Island broke America. And Katy Perry. What? Katy Perry called me a hun. 
Oh my Jesus. That's incredible. That is amazing. Isn't it? Honestly, I don't I was like looking forward to like little mix or like just someone and from England, America. someone that's yeah. like my age and I was gonna be absolutely gassed. When it was Katy Perry, like I wanted a, a medic and a priest on site because I thought I was gonna keel yeah. over. <laughs> but oh I God. have slid into a few DMs as well. Have you? No boys. Oh. Yeah. Who's the MDC into? So I found girls really, really hard. Who did you find girls yeah. from? So I literally searched Miss Banks' followers to see if she followed me back. Because I followed she? her long before. Like I've been like fangirling for like, right. a few years now. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. And she followed me back. So then oh, I, I messaged her. Like, what did you? What did you say? I was like, oh my god, hi. <laughs> <laughs> it's just so embarrassing. Like, shoot your shot. Like I'm just yes. gonna shoot my shot hard. I don't think she replied. Miss Banks, if you're if you're watching this, please reply. <laughs> Massive well, I'm sure she's busy, she's got a lot to do, but I've never said So, out of everything in there, if you round it all up, what is the best thing that you've learned about yourself from going into the, the villa? I think I've learned, um, and this is only just by coming out, that being me is enough. Cause, I love that. Yeah, and obviously I didn't know that in there, because so I didn't know the reaction I was getting and whatnot. But, yeah, like, I can just... I used to get scared in there that because I was quite leery or because I used to be quite loud that oh it's a bit unattractive like no one's gonna like that. I know and then obviously when Molly come back she wasn't as loud as me and I was like oh my god that's that's why and I need to be like that and then when I come out yeah when I come out it was like reassuring that trust me there's nothing wrong with being loud (laughs) it's done me all right in life so all my all my mates love you. Free. Hey, listen, but you look at I set you up. She's single now. <laughs> I know. Well, to be fair, I went in there single, came out single, and just came out of a town. Yeah, yeah but you've got a lot of friends it. now. Yeah, and a town gives you a lot less ag than a man. But, that but, is good. Yeah, I boy. love that. <laughs> Oh my, oh, oh my god, yeah, I don't even mean them, they just come out. It's like they honestly, do. They literally. So, what's next for Charlotte? What, what do you want to do now? Sleep. <laughs> oh, I can imagine. Like, I don't even know. Like, 2019 was probably the last time I had a good sleep. Oh, mate, it's nightmare in there. Oh. Hour or two a night. And yeah, that. snoring. Oh. It was intense. But I am just looking for it. everything right now is a dream. Like, mm. even looking at things on Instagram and talking to like management companies, I'm like, it all Wait, sounds it? amazing. But it's like, are you sure for me? Like, oh. it's still a bit overwhelming. Still a yeah. bit extremely overwhelming. How long have you been up for now? Um, four days. Yeah. yeah. That's the thing as well. I haven't watched a series, but I know I was myself in there. Yeah. But now it's almost like people's got an expectation. Yes, of me. exactly. And even though I know it was me anyway, yeah. I'm like, well, what if I'm not that? Or what yeah, if I go I'm not like that all another... the time. Yeah, yeah, exactly. No, I found that really hard. But I know, like, I've got a few big decisions to make, yeah. and I need to make them pretty snappy. And I just want to get things right. Like, I just want to help mum. Like sort my little brother out, and if I can do that, then it was all worthwhile. Yeah. Even though I didn't survive cash and I wanna ask you first. What's your prediction on who will win your next leave? Like, what do you think will happen in the final? So, literally, if Pin don't win, I'm right <laughs> to Ofcom. They have to win. Pin to win. Page and Finn to win. Hashtag Pin to win. Pin to win. They pin have to, to win. win. Are we spelling that with two ends? Yeah, of course. Um, yeah, I mean, it's one. Yeah. to win. Do you know what is funny? When me and Callum done this game, I can't remember. I think it. Was, I can't remember what it was called, but it was basically seeing who knew the most about each other. At that time, when we played that game, Paige did not like Finn. She was like, "I'm not feeling him. I'm gonna walk all over him. This, that, and the other." She don't walk all over Finn. No, no. but no. I tell you what, when Finn tells her off, she loves it. Like her eyes go. Yeah. She loves she it. Yeah, it. But she it. was scared that he would never tell her off. Oh, but he does. Yeah. Oh no, he would. Like, but he when we when stuff. we played that game, she was not feeling it, right. and they smashed everyone. And I think Paige started thinking, "Oh my god, like we actually we know a lot about each other." Yeah. And there were some where they guessed and they got it right. And they won that whole challenge. Yeah. Um, so they've got a win. And who do I think will leave next? Um, it's difficult. I don't know people's perceptions on, obviously, anyone. And I'm going purely based on time. I think 
Demi and Luke um, might be vulnerable. Yeah, well, do you know what? I think there's going to be a massive shock. I think Mike and Priscilla might grab it. Oh, no, I don't think so. No? No, I don't think he's... He, the public They're have taken boyfriend to Mike so now. much. They're girlfriend boyfriend now. Yeah, but I just don't... Adrian Finn and Luke and... Um, Actually, Jess and Ched. They're exclusive. They're not together. But... I do see them working, to be fair, on the outside. 100%. Yeah. That's what Eve said. Eve said she needs someone from like London way... Bit more, yeah. Like, and he's he's cool, man. Yeah, yeah. Them two are so cute. So you're together. going for Paige and Finn. Paige and Finn to win. Mike and Priscilla. I would go for Shanice and Luke. I want no. I want Pin to win, but then I do want Shanice and Luke to be there. I don't know whether Shanice is like a girls' girl, but I just think as a couple, they they do really do. And from what I've seen, I think it's between them two. Yeah, a hundred percent. And I think it will be tight, but I've got to go with Paige. So, at the end of every Q&A, mm-hmm. we now have a bonus round. This is a new thing, G. Is okay. it? Yeah, it's a new thing no, we I have. I missed out. Yeah, this is mandatory. Um, so, basically, the person we have in, the special guest, has to do a death. I knew you were Ooh, I like this. <laughs> I like this. This is a draw out. I'm, I'm going to be honest. A draw it is. Yeah. Do you know, if this was the Yanchi Black, this is bad. All right, listen. This is bad. <laughs> Let's not do it too bad. I'm thinking maybe... So you said you've got an event, haven't you, on Sunday yeah. with Naz and Connor with a G. Yeah. Right, and Naz is your like, you really close me? friend. I think we call Naz and we tell him, <gasps> maybe you want to pull Connor or G with a chat. For a chat. Oh, for a chat. I have chat. been pulling people chat, chat. to chats all January. <laughs> okay. I've had enough. We don't have to do it, I'm just saying. I mean, I'll do it. <laughs> there we are. <laughs> right, let's give Naz a call and let's say you want to pull Connor with a G for a chat. Oh, oh my god! This is right. Welcome to the Oh my! I'm sorry, but the pied off once again. He's ringing me back, he's ringing me back. Shh! Hello? Hello? Hey, Orange. <laughs> oh, mate, I don't miss that laugh. Joe. Are you on a are you on a submarine or something? Why have you got such poor signal? Is it is it bad? I mean it's alright now, it's alright. Okay, it's a stop complaining then, alright. No. Oh mate, I've had enough. Uh, it's been five seconds and I have already had enough. Ah. <laughs> I wanted to let you know that I've officially got the invite for Sunday. Yes, yes, I've been waiting for you to tell me. Yeah, so it's told me. I made the guest list, can you believe it? I, it's a, in all honesty, I can't believe it. Are you, I, you're an absolute waste man. Go away, I'm going to get you struck off. Oh, right, I need to say something. Go on. I saw on the email who's going. So it's me, you, Soph and Connor with a G. Yeah. I think I'm going to, I think I'm going to pull Connor for a chat. Are you joking? No, why are you coming at me like that? What, Conor OG? Yeah, I'm not Conor OG, obviously. But, oh, mate, don't. If you tell him, I'll say I'll kick off. Oh, yeah, shut up! <laughs> You're an idiot! Listen, the boy's gorgeous. He is, to be fair. He is, he is, he is. I mean, yeah, shoot your shot, why not? Because my birthday's the next day as well, so. So. I don't know what relevance that has at all. I know, I don't care, to be honest, but. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why I even mentioned it, to be honest. Do you, no, but do you think I've got a chance? Because this is a bit mad. Like, I'll proper like him. Um, you know, it's one of them, I can have a word with him in there because I think me and him might sign the same agency. No! I can't just be like, oh, what are you saying? Like, what's it like being back? What, what are you thinking about Sunday? So, what are you thinking about Shauna? Do you think, I'm, what I'm thinking is, obviously, I'm, I'll have a few drinks in that. Do you think it'll be a bit much if I, like, go in for the kill? <laughs> Like, oh, join up with a breakfast I, club and that. Oh, my. <laughs> no, I'm joking. I'm going to go that far. I'm Actually, Catholic. Man. I'm Catholic. Man. Man. No, no? Why not? Shoot your shot. you got one million followers. No one's going to That was sick. Right, so you've been pranked. Oh, mate. I'm joking. I'm with Joe and Georgia Steele. Oh, hey, And hey, you've guys. been pranked. Hi, Nurse. How you doing, you bro? You've been pranked by I Saw It First. <laughs> Mate, I can't believe you went to wingman it. Full Cupid mode, I love it. 
I Listen, love that. this boy is so used to being in the friend zone. That's all he I has. actually love that. So he straight away was back and he was like, yeah, let's do it. Let's go for it. Thank you, Naz. Appreciate it, bro. Thank you, Naz, for your participation. I hate you. Bye. 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 Oh, that, <laughs> that, was so he that was so good. That was so good. He the best liar ever. Well, honestly, man, you've been drama school, so that was no, incredible. That was good, Shauna. Should Shauna and, uh, and Connor the G have a chat? Should they have a chat? What I'm going to take Comment below. So where's your head at? <laughs> have you not noticed the sexual tension? <laughs> Stops. I can't wait. Oh, oh god. god. Thanks so much for watching that bonus round. That was honestly an incredible day. I'm loving this now. I'm loving this. Yeah, that was amazing. And catch us next time, alright?